Susan Gregg thought she was too young to be diagnosed with glaucoma, even though her doctor was monitoring her eye pressure. I'm young. I'm not in, in what I consider in the older population, and I thought, oh, I've got, you know, 10 or 20 more years before it really becomes more of a serious situation. So I was surprised. Glaucoma causes slow but irreversible damage to the optic nerve when too much pressure builds up from fluid in the front part of the eye that doesn't drain. You sort of reflect. You think, okay, you know, you start thinking, how would you deal with losing eyesight in one eye or both eyes? And it's not an easy thing to think about. Glaucoma patients are usually prescribed eye drops to reduce pressure, but they can stop working, which happened to Susan. Her concerns about side effects from various other medication options made her want to try laser surgery. I have a busy job. I didn't want things to interfere with my job and my life, so I thought, you know, let's try the laser. What do, what do I have to lose? It applies energy um, to the cells that are in the natural drain of the eye, and that energy seems to stimulate the cells to basically do their job better. It's sort of like this solar beam you see circling your eye and there was no pain. It was more towards the end I felt sort of the intenseness of the heat. Laser surgery at Harborview Medical Center lowered Susan's eye pressure, but she will still need to keep using eye drops. From the UW Medicine Newsroom in Seattle, this is Megan Clark.